Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome once again to Fancode DCC X10 Rapid Fire Division Two Match Number Seven. And we are live from Vision Cricket Centre. All the focus is on this upcoming game: Cool Boys versus Z Games. Right then, news from the centre is that Cool Boys have won the toss and elected to bat first. Good evening, Shoaib, and we've got a very exciting lineup of games in the Fancode DCC X10 Division Two event. As we have a look at the lineups. Cool boys, Mohammad Rizwan Khan, the captain, Hamid Nawaz, Zaman Atari, Mohammad Roman, Farhad Khan, Ali Anwar, Faiza Nawan, Mohammad Atik, the wicketkeeper, Zishan Ali, Neet Priya Kevin, and Zahir Siddiqui. And for Z Games, it is Shah Rukh Mohammad Amin, the captain, Mohammad Jawadullah, Ali Iqbal, Glenn Fernandez, Mohammad Ejaz Sajid, Faisal Altaf, Nadir Hussain, Furkan Khalil, Akshay Rathor, Mohammad Ismail, and Lovepreet Bajwa. So ball number one, Jawadullah Ullah, that's uh, a wide, will be down the leg side. Good ball, very good ball. Now this time he wants to run for it, Rizwan doesn't, directed at the stumps. Directeds are always very close and I think he was short of uh, the crease there. It's always good to have that in your arsenal. This one's down the leg side, that's what happens when you try to overdo things this one after that bouncer trying to get that ball in but Shah Rukh's obviously thinking otherwise he's, he's perhaps recognized something that we haven't and there it is <laughs> as Ismail takes that wicket clean bold yes that arm ball in has been played nice and clear the mid off fielder that's going to go all the way for four runs a good end to otherwise a good over for Z games I think with Abdul Rahman not here, we can call it Z Games or whatever <laughs> we want. As that's gone down the leg side for a wide. And five wides conceded. Again, their fast bowlers are a little bit erring in line and length. Short ball pulled behind square leg. That's going to race away towards the boundary for four. A good controlled shot played it in the gap. Right, so we are back and the first ball has been hit straight down the ground between the two fielders and what a great start this is for cool boys. That smacked, what a good looking shot that is, a lot of power in that shot, brute force coming into effect and all that shuffling has uh, definitely... Thanks a lot uh, Shoaib and uh, Khais bhai. Straight away, there's a wicket. A slow delivery in the air, trying to heave over mid wicket, got the top edge. It was miles up in the air. <coughs> Ali Anwar comes into bat and straight away, a wild swing, poor cricketing shot by Ali Anwar. The ball coming into the left hand bat and cleans the middle stumps. Well, now it's done and dusted, we move on. Another flighted delivery and belted down the ground for a maximum by Fezan Awan. Comes in Ali. Once again going on the back foot uh, play towards the mid wicket. A chase for the fielder. But quick outfield. The ball racing towards the fence. Provide those big shots. Oh, struck plum in front. And yes, given. He missed the full delivery. And Hamid Nawaz has been sent back. Mohammed Ismail. Producing yet another wicket. So I would trust him in that scenario. Smashed hard through the covers. And brilliant fielding. No, Glenn Fernandez. Good effort. But it just beats him and rolls over the boundary rope for uh, four runs. Once again, this time more towards extra. Finds the gap. Back to back boundaries for Zaman Atari. He has that low back lift. But terrific, terrific bat speed. Can they get up to the triple figure mark? That would be interesting. Short ball over the keeper. Top edge. Well, the young fast bowler losing his head there a little bit. That's a poor delivery with third man up. A talented all-rounder Nadir Hussain comes in to bowl the final over. Starts with the slower delivery. Played straight towards the long off fielder coming down. 
an easy catch taken by Lovepreet. That's the end of Zaman Atari. Once again, a slower delivery dispatched over long on. Huge, huge six by Zahir Siddiqui. Well, that was in the slot. Pace on. Can he finish out well here? Oh, nice one. That back of the hander. He's refused the single Faizan. It was a slow start to the innings. Rizwan and Rahman only contributing one run between them. Even Atik or Rahman couldn't get going. And Ali were gone for a golden duck. That was a huge blow. 15 extras helping them along to 91. Like we mentioned earlier, Zahid, 13 of 4. And Zaman Atari contributing. Two wickets for Mohammed Ismail. Glenn Fernandez, two wickets as well. The two left-arm tweakers getting four wickets between them. And Nader Hussain with the final wicket in his final over. So, decent job done by the Z Games strikers bowlers. Hello and welcome once again to Fancode DCC X10 Rapid Fire this is Division 2. Match number 7, we are live from Vision Cricket Centre. The game is between Cool Boys and Z Game Strikers. And my name is Shoaib Ahmed. Good evening. We're, we're in for an interesting second half in this first game of the day. I feel... I feel uh, Z Games would have been the happier side going back to the dugout at the end of that first half because 90 is just roughly par as we see the first ball being played towards the square leg area by Furkan Khalil and he's off with a boundary. Uh, playing in a live event. But he looks, he looks good. He's got a good run up. He's got a very smooth action like you said. As Furkan Khalil has flicked that towards the vacant mid-wicket area that sailed over the ropes for a six. And Furkan is on the go, expecting the batsman to hit. Catch it is the call. It's played over the mid-off fielder. Easy runs. This is power playovers. And that's another beautiful shot from Furkan Khalil from Faisan. Good ball in the swing in the air, but he's got that right from the middle of the bat. Clean hit, and Furkan Khalil gets six runs. That's a slower ball, and Furkan has hit that again over that long on fielder for another maximum. And again, surprising that someone like someone as experienced as Ali Anwar or or the wicketkeeper, in fact is not signalling it to, to his captain as Furkan Khalil has just hit that down Atik's throat. First ball, the spinner has been introduced and look at that clean hit. What a great hit this is. Over mid-wicket, it's gone the distance. The captain... Touch ...in domestic events this season. As he plays another one towards that long gone mid-wicket area in the gap. It's gone for a six. The fielder has confer is confirming that it's a maximum. Make that third. The third six of the over. Shah Rukh Muhammad Amin has taken a liking to Farhad and his bowling. Rightly said, uh, Ahmed. And nowadays it's all about T20 and uh, T10. And this time, lucky coming down the track. A low full toss guided towards the third man by Shah Rukh Amin. Yet another boundary coming from the blade of uh, Amin. Six gone, 73 for one. Used to be very sound technical batsmen we used to watch. And this time uh, trying for the scoop shot. The batter misses, the keeper misses. The ball racing towards the fence. It's his first game in the side. This time he belts it straight. And that's gone like a rocket. Too long off for a boundary. Much better from left Preet Singh Bajwa. Half volley. Does it again. Repeats the shot. And this time dropped by Atiko Rahman. And to add salt to the wound, it's gone for a boundary. Three runs remaining. And he goes for it towards long on. It'll be a maximum to end the contest. The Z game striker winning comfortably by nine wickets. The top order, Furkan Khalil, Shah Rukh Amin, and Lovepreet Singh Bajwa settling the contest in less than eight overs. Well played by the strikers. 
So that is the batting scorecard for the strikers. 33 of 16. It was a quick start by Furkan Khalil in the power play. Then Shahrukh Amin just held it all together. 34 not out of 20. And Lovepreet Singh Bajwa. Quick fire, 24 of 12. And in the bowling analysis, Ali Anwar, the sole wicket taker. Other than that, a lot of options tried, but nobody really paying off for cool boys. So that is the match summary for you. Cool boys batting first posted a score of 91 for 6 in their allotted 10 overs. Faisal Anwar, the standout batter with 34 of 22. Mohamed Ismail and Glenn Fernandez, two wickets apiece. And in response, Z Game Strikers gunning it down in less than eight overs. Thanks to Shah Rukh Mohammed, that means 34 not out of 20. Furkan Khalid, 33 of 16. And Lovepreet Singh Bajwa with the winning runs, 24 not out of 12. Ali Anwar, the sole wicket taker, as Z Game Strikers won comfortably by nine wickets.